presented in partnership with the University of Phoenix. An educated world is a better world. We met Carmel Williams, a seafood inspector with the Department of Commerce. She's like fish quality control. And weirdly, worms don't alarm her. So I've got a couple little nematodes that are in the filet. And normally you can't see it. So we have a candling table. And then you can see we've got one small one right here. She's curled up. And we've got one right here. Just oh, right there. already That's pulled a nice out. One. OK. Can I dig one of these out? Yes. Uh, so where am I? This one right here. The little guy right, right in there. there. You can see him sort of back. Mm -hmm. Hold on a sec. Can you see him okay, Martin? You got a nice tight... Can you see him in there? Oh, yeah. Look at him. Hold him right now. Like there you that. go. You got him. Worm catcher. Thank you. We don't know what kind it is. No. Nope. But there are thousands and thousands of different kinds, and many of them are called nematodes? Yeah, well, these are some kind of nematodes. Yes. Whatever it is, it's conceivably a lineage of life that's older than humanity. So this is an old thing, passed from body to body like a story. Well, <laughs> is this is this okay? Yes. It's it's natural. Well, lightning's natural. Mm -hmm. I avoid it. <laughs> Sharks are natural. I gotta tell you, I eat sushi three or four times a week. I still plan to, but I will never look at my beloved sashimi the same way. This has been eye-opening and just a little bit disgusting. That, I think, is the image we want to leave you with. Or do I want to leave it with, with you? I think I'll leave it with you. <laughs>